Today we will read again Vilapakus Manjali, verse 74. The last time we stopped in the certain point of the explanation of Srila Ananta, this Babaji, and today we will continue. Okay. Is it okay for you? Yeah, very good. Okay. Okay, so I read the verse, the main verse again. Mm. O Madura Muki, sweet faced girl, when the wind carries your excellent bodily fragrance to Chandravali's handmade playbed, where Mukunda enjoys with her. Krishna finds a clever excuse to meet you on the shore of your lake, Radha Kunda, like a bumblebee leaving an inferior flower. When will I proudly witness this? So I will repeat the verse again. So in the frame, can you uh, read a bit slower for the translator? Thank you. Can you read? Okay. Okay. Sorry, I will do. Yes. O Madura Muki, sweet faced girl, when the wind carries your excellent bodily fragrance to Chandravali's handmade playbed where Mukunda enjoys with her. Krishna finds a clever excuse to meet you on the shore of your lake, Radha Kunda, like a bumblebee leaving on inferior flower. When will I proudly witness this? So now we continue on the notes in which time we stopped mm -hmm. the last time. A heroine who has received a hint from her hero mm -hmm. to meet him in a certain twisting place who eagerly waits there for him and meanwhile decorates herself and the grove is called a Vasaka Sachika. The activities of such a heroine are planning the erotic games with her hero, looking out for him to come, discussing blissful topics with her girlfriends, and constantly looking out for girl messengers to come. Nagara is too late and Tulasi looks out for him again and again. The Rasika aspirant devotees of Vrindavan should also always meditate on themselves as assisting Swamini 
in this way, always staying by her side. Yeah. The asp Guru, Guru Dev, yeah, excuse me. I meant to have one. Always staying by her side. Always staying by her <laughs> Not Christmas. <laughs> yeah, go on. The aspirant should always float along on the waves of Swamini's happiness and distress without being completely absorbed in mm -hmm. Swarupa Vesh. Yeah. These feelings cannot be experienced. Mm -hmm. What is so what? No, 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 repeat this line. Come okay. Here. No. Okay. Mm. Without being completely absorbed in Swarupavish. These feelings cannot be experienced. What feeling? The feelings of Swamini's happiness and distress. Wow. Very nice. Go in the frame. Beautiful. Should I if continue, Kurdish? If you're not in near to him, how you can feel it? To feel it, you have to be very close to him. Can you call me and say, I'm in class? Yeah. Hi. Mm -hmm. See, see, this is Yeah, go on. Hello? Also, uh, also a person like me is actually living in Vrindavan. <coughs> He does not have any experience. I am always absorbed in bodily consciousness. Not even in dreams, I think of myself as Radha's maid servant. Read again. There is no other. Yes. Repeat also again. a person. Yes. Also a person like me is actually living in Vrindavan. He does not have any experience. I am always absorbed bodily consciousness not even in dreams i think of myself as radha's maid servant uh -huh. there is no other way than surrender yeah. Clear? Should we continue? Yes, sure. Yes. This is the condition. Go. Condition of surrender. Uh, 
why they say surrender to gurudev surrender to navigator who will navigate you right way navigation is important because he can navigate you in right way विदाउट सलेंडर ऑफ नेविगेटर ही शो यू द राइट वे वे टू सलेंडर Class, class, class. Right. Hmm. So, but our, our nature, we receive as a soul. Super soul is very independent. Prabhu Pad is writing in last. paragraph of bhagavad gita he say our i am so uh, super soul is independent so soul also have very independent thing. so we don't want to surrender why because we are want to be independent and when we are not surrendered then we cannot be close we cannot understand the the happy and distress of some around the read Kaudya Vaishnavas should take exclusive shelter of the lotus feet of the gopis. Vraja Pura Manitara Charana Ashraya Sara Korumana Ekanta Koriya. This is from um, Takura Mahashaya. O oh, mind, the essential thing is to take exclusive shelter of the lotus feet of the Vraja Gopis. Vraja. Shri Pat Prabodhananda Saraswati has said, Kada. Siang, Shri Radhe, Chakita, Iha, Vrindavana, Huvi. This is from Radharasa Sudanidi 211. Oh, Shri Radhe, when can I live in Vrindavan in total devotional anxiety? Shri Krishna is late for his appointment swamini becomes more and more upset now here is a first from uchwala nilamani naika when the innocent beloved did not show up for a long time the heroine becomes very anxious out of separation from him in that condition she is called an utkantita naika by the novas of rasa her activities consist of a burning heart 
shivering, speculating about why he does not show up, illness, shedding tears, and speaking about her own situation. The Mahajans describe the lamentations of an Utkantita as follows. I made the bed for my lover and strung a flower garland for him. I prepared betel leaves and I lit the lamps. I made the powerhouse very beautiful, but, oh, my friend, all this will turn out differently. I will not meet my hero, who is an ocean of attributes. I deceived my mother in love, my sister in law, to come into the deep forest. And with great effort, I decorated my beautiful, youthful body to meet my lover. I'm looking down the road for him to come, telling my mind that this crown jewel of relishes will certainly come now. Thus sings the wretched Chandidas. Krishna, while on the way to meet Radhika, had met Shaiba and Padma. The girlfriends of Radhika's rival, Chandravali, who had taken him to Chandravali's Kunja, where a bed of yasmin flowers made by Chandravali's own hands was waiting for him. When Sri Radhika, waiting in her own kunja, became desperate, the wind of Vrindavan thought to himself, let me see what I can do. And became Radhika's servant by carrying her sublime fragrance into Chandravali's kunja and straight into Madhusudana's nostrils. Shyamasundara became startled, suddenly got up from Chandravali's handmade bed of flowers and told her, Dearest one, I completely forgot. My mother told me to do something for her and I just went off without finishing that duty. I have to go right now. Naive Chandravali, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> Naive Chandravali 
seeing Krishna's anxiety, <laughs> said, Go and come back as soon as you have finished your duties. Our hero then promptly followed Radhika's excellent fragrance like a bee, Madhupam Eva, who leaves all the other flowers to search for a blooming golden honey-filled lotus flower. That is the glory of her exclusive love. Sri Vishwanath Chakravati says in Radharani's name, also all the gopis have causeless love for Krishna. Still, he is mostly attached to me. All the people know that. That can never be false. He considers my love to be endless, like the Mount Meru, whereas he does not compare the love of the other gopis for him. Even with three or four mustard seeds, Actually, Chandravali has been made a rival equal to Sri Radha in the Leela by Rasa itself. Just to make Krishna relish Sri Radha's different delectable moods like Utkanta, Mana, Peak, and Kalahantarita, girl repenting, having picked a quarrel. Actually, Sri Radha's love is beyond comparison. Tulasi stands at the gate of the Kunja when Krishna arrives there and says, Tulasi, here I have come. Arrange for my meeting with Tulasi at them by saying, where you do you come from? Where have you been all this time? Swamini is very upset and is crying because of you. Tell me the truth. Otherwise, I won't let you meet her. Krishna shortly and honestly explains to Tulasi, why he is delayed. And when Tulasi hears that, she has been, uh, mm. sorry, that he has been to Chandravali's Kunja, she becomes very upset and says, Oh, that's why you are so late. Go, go there where you come from. 
I cannot let you meet her. I will sing your glories to Swamini. Our hero then offers hundreds of prayers to Tulasi with folded hands until she finally allows him to come in and see Radhika. How, comple how complete is the Manjari's control over Sri Krishna? Because Nagara is making so many endeavors and because Nagara and Nagarimani are so eager to meet, Tulasi finally allows them to meet. Tulasi's heart is filled with pride when she sees that the love fragrance of Swamini draw Nagara right out of Chandravali's Kunja back into her own domain. Krishna cannot stay anywhere else for even a moment without my Swamini. Therefore, Krishna is ours. This pride fills Tulasi's heart. Garvam achakshate talpang vi rot karsha sucha kam. This is from Hari Vallabha. This pride overseeing the superiority of Krishna's enjoyment with the heroine over, own, over one's own party, over Krishna's enjoyment with the enemy party. In his Uchvala Nilamani, Srila Rupa Goswami gives the following example of this pride. One day the gopis were listening to Nandi Muki, a learned Brahman girl, reciting the Puranas. When Padma saw her rival Lalita dozing off, she sarcastically laughed. So Lalita told her, Saki, you are the crown jewel of fortunate girls because you can happily sleep on your balconies in the moonlight autumn nights. But we don't know when we can enjoy such fruits of virtues works from previous lives ourselves. <clears throat> Whenever we fall asleep in the caves of Vrindavan, some mad blackish elephant, Krishna, forcibly us up to make love with us. We are 
much more attractive to him than you. Tulasi's heart is filled with similar pride over the superiority of Radha's own party, over the party of her enemies. Suddenly, the vision, uh, sorry, suddenly the vision vanishes and Tulasi prays as follows. Just as a bee flies from flower to flower, attracted to their excellent sweet smell. Similarly, Sri Govinda, the king of lovers, madly leaves the bed of yasmin flowers that was handmade by Chandravali to go to the bank of Radhakunda whenever a favorable wind carries Radhika's lotus-like bodily fragrance to him. Shri Madhusudana, the Rasika B. Krishna, will be enchanted by her Radhika's face, which is as sweet as a, a blooming lotus flower. And by her bod beautiful body, which is the limit of sweetness and whose fragrance fills the whole of Vrindavan with honey-like sweetness. When will the nectar sweet fragrance of your lotus feet madden my nostrils? O Ishwari, O moon of King Vrishabhanu's family, let me soothe my heart by singing your glories. So this is the end of the notes of Sri Anandadas Babaji's explanations. Any question? Ask to others. Or further, read something. This is the lead to meditate that. It's no explanation to this. Leela to meditate. We have that honey that comes out of the flower. Yeah. That's the question. No, 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 no. Jaiho, Tare Rade. <laughs> that honey la jeo. The honey that comes out of the flower, this is called parak. 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 This parak, no? Okay, rade. 
I'll give you back. Do you want to Yeah. This is Parak, no? Yeah. Good. Well, how is it possible that Krishna went to Chandravali? Even he knows that Radhika is waiting for him. Why he is going there? Chandravali tricked to go on Krishna. Tricked? Oh. Catch him. Yeah. Tricking. But when he remember that this time I have to go there to Radhika, then smell. The smell also comes. And the mind also goes because of the smell. That he said that I have some words of mother. And escape <laughs> And Chandravali is also helping to Radha because she is the expansion of love. So she is helping to Radha to expand the Lila, new Lila to be. To increase the love. Mm -hmm. Sorry, <laughs> 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 Okay, good. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Uh -huh. He is bringing or not? Yeah, yeah, bringing every day. They only. They only come, they are expansion of Radha to expand their love, divine love. How love makes to suffer and why angerness is coming in. So Mahabhav is also including these feelings. Yeah. So if you see the angerness is also part of the love. If you eat only sweet, you will not become tired with eating sweet. Sure. If you have a sour or so sweet also. Salty also. You can eat more or less. Yes. Then after all, sweet becomes more sweet. More. Yeah. Very nice. Go in that way. Do you have any question? Yes, I have a question. Um, when Krishna is by Chandravali, and she has the impress, or she 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 was thinking, yes, Krishna loves me more than anyone else. Isn't that Krishna is always by Radharani? Radharani is in is in Krishna's heart, yes, and Krishna is in Radharani. Yes, I say. I love everyone. This is problem. Krishna says, I love everyone, every living being. And Radhika says, no, no, no. 
I know love everyone. So I love only my Krishna. And Krishna nature to love everyone. Understand? If you you do, totally you want to give everything to Krishna, he will he will also behave like I love everyone. Radharani love is this that I have no love to everyone. I only know Krishna and I love Krishna. Not say so whose love is I have. Go in the frame. Yes, say, I, I understand it. Why not say Krishna love is lower, Radhika love is higher? You still you have a soft corner for Krishna. Why not say boldly? <laughs> He is still in a <laughs> He keeps out corner for going down. Right? Uh, excuse me, Gurudev. The, the connection is, is not so good. I It is always shivering and interrupted. I understand. I don't know. The other devotees have all that experience? Yeah, your voice is very good. My internet is little problem going on. So Suniti will share. My voice is not so little slow. Read. Read, you want to speed up. So, Niti, you want to read something? No, but I would like to. Yeah. your Not really. Why I like this point, Gordi, where the wind uh, is serving also Srimati Radhika. Let me see what I can do. And he's putting her fragrance in himself carries this to Krishna to wow. remind him, ah, don't go to this uh, inferior flower, the Swamini is waiting for you, you are late. That is the pearl. Wow. And then also the pearl is uh, the pride of the Manjaris when they are actually in this position that you speak sometimes good if they are and managing Radha and Krishna separately and trying to make them uh, eager again for meeting when Swamini is uh, in Man in, in some proud anger. And then they, they uh, chastise Krishna. And we see this is the, the power of the mandaris of the maid servants that they chastise Krishna and they say, where have you been? You can go back where you came from. Swamini will, doesn't want to see you. And then sometimes you tell us that also Swamini, she wants to see him, but the, the mandaris, they make her more eager. They say, no, no, let him wait a little bit more longer. Let him be more eager to see you. Don't give up so easily your anger. And then uh, they are like, going back and forth or Tulsi Manjari is going back and forth and she is increasing their desire to meet again and to to make up again in this uh, difficult circumstances and this is called the man before the pranai that uh, actually when there is some angerness before they come together it is increases the sweetness of the meeting and the Manjaris are bringing this about Tulsi Manjari is bringing this about. So I think this is a very sweet uh, uh, meditation. And they are proud of this. 
because they they are so much in oneness with Sri Radhika that they don't want anybody else. Uh, only Sri Radhika's uh, how do you say uh, victory. They want to be victorious in uh, Swamini's service to bring Krishna back. You are often also uh, talking about this to the the pride of the mandri to to unite both of them in even a higher uh, eagerness of of meeting and loving. Pride of mandri to be in Peru. Then it comes. Okay. When I'm in my saru, eager is coming and we block to Krishna not to meet Radha. I am so strong to <laughs> control to the Supreme. Uh, Supreme. <laughs> this is the pride of Mandri. If I live in my saru, Radharani give so much mercy and power in us that we can control even the Creator. <laughs> because they are blocking us, now we can block them. <laughs> what they cannot do without their effort. This is the pride of Mandiri. And this is the gift given by Mahaprabhu and his Acharya, his Goswamis. Sanatana Goswami, who gives Sambandha Gyan and Rupanda Gyan. There are six Goswami, but Raj Bhakti, Raj Bhakti, Rupanda Gyan. Because Chaitanya Chaitanya is only explaining about true Prabhupada because Mahaprabhu sent him for Vindhava to realize about Avideha and what is the life for you, the goal of life. And that plan of Paryojan is the goal that's a Manjari one. Manjari has only one Paryojan, same Paryojan. So, God is not my goal, frame is goal, in between divine cup. To how to harmonize, to be there always in loving action. That is a manjari for you. God is not a goal, frame is the goal. And maybe I want to share with you that this morning we were speaking about planning of Leela of Radhashtami. Yeah. And then we. Uh, yeah. And then. <laughs> this morning we are planning. Uh, Radashtami day and, and, and on Tuesday is Radashtami. And then uh, Gurdiv was explaining to us the mood of when they meet and uh, Nanda Baba and uh, Kirti Damaya, they, they are finding uh, Shimati Radhika and this golden lotus flower, Nanda Baba, uh, Rishabhanu Baba. And then uh, she is uh, in this golden lotus flower and he uh, He's very joyful. Oh, finally, we have a baby because also they, they could not have a baby. And Kirti Damaya was always eager to have a girl. And then they meet. And, and that day, they meet also uh, Yashoda Maya and Nanda Baba. And then, uh, but they are very not so happy they come there, but they are a little bit sad. 
And then Gurudev said, this is the mood of them because they have Krishna, but they are a little bit worried because the uh, Kangsa wants to kill their son. And so Nanda Baba is very little bit so not so happy. And then uh, Brisha Banu Baba asking him, why are you not happy? You have a boy, we have a girl. No, but Sivan King is asking for Nanda. Yes, Brisha Banu King yeah. is asking Nanda Baba. Why are you not happy? Yes, we are, because… You we, got the son and you are not happy. Yes, good if you say, it's so sweet. You are not happy, you have a son and you are not happy. And I'm… I got the daughter and we are happy that we are so lucky in old age. We have a one daughter, then Kirtidama said, also she is not opening her eyes, but I am very happy that I have a one girl in my, to, I got it, one girl and she is my daughter. And then they invite them, not Udi, because he said... Then, he said, why not? You are happy, Nanda. You have a... In old age, you got the son and you are not happy. He said, really, we are very worried after getting son. So why? The, the parents become happy in old age that he has a son. Why you are not happy? He said, I'm worried always how to put this. A Kansa is making too much problem to kill the boys. Oh, if you want to free from this worry, come to my kingdom. Is is near Basane. You come, I will give you place and stay there. So, so they start thinking it's good to not go. He said, then Nandwa said, I need big land to keep my cows and my children and family. He said, I will give you, come. All empire is my place. Then you will see near Barsane, this Nandagram is there. So he gives Nandagram. From Chata, one road is going to Barsane. That old road is there making. So he is walking, walking Chata, Chatikara Chata, and then they went to Barsane and they, by that way, they went to Nandaga. But it is six kilometers from Barsane. Then Kansa is back to the class. Then after that, they send the Putra. Mm. That way, what happened when Putra checking milk, she cried and shouting. And this way Krishna jumped from, and her body was very big, so it's up to Barsane, Nanda gone to Barsane. So he jumped up to, to see that again. Nandani house, give the Ma house, and then 
He is near to Radharani. And then Radha opened the eyes. This is the part. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Anything more? Okay. And discuss. His internet is poor selling. Internet is good. Internet is good. Anyone has a question or anything? Uh, today is okay. So, Gurudev, when we celebrate the Rashtami, can I ask this? Yeah. So, we meditate on Radhika as a baby. Mm. But as Manjuris, we meditate her as a young adolescent girl. So how do these two, two bhavs work then for us? Honestly, the, who is meditating in the Manjuri bhav, they know she like it. They see like and we make the birthday party mm -hmm. appearance. Mm -hmm. of my son. You make your appearance, they become baby or what? <laughs> Only to make the party. Only to make the day because you appear, so we want to Prabhupada say, more feasting today. <laughs> feast more, feasting it. <coughs> This is today more feasting. So this is the mercy of Radhika. We can meet my old friends and we can sit together, sing together, dance together and be happy and remember what a beauty thing happened to my Swami. And what is happening with the Krishna in between Radha and Krishna? Always they exchange the love. Hmm. Why I will see child? We have to keep one bow, one feeling. What I see you, I see you. And I love my seeing. And I want to make more confirm to that scene. Mm. Who has no Samanda relation, they see child, young, old, like this. Ages. And the, who has the manjari of fixed nature, they always see one, one, one mallow. They are living in mallow of Dasi and Swami. Mm. This he always <sighs> And neutral push, passive relation, they change their mood because the mood is not fixed state. Is okay? <laughs> Yeah. I have a question. I'm gonna yes, I go back to the verse from Govinda Ben. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm meditating on this experience of Swamini that of the waves of the wave between bliss and anxiety that was described in the verse, mm. that she feels both. And of course, we know that Mahaprabhu has come to us to relish this 
experience of love, which is the waves. Yeah, but personally, personally speaking, as a naive disciple, I don't want my Swamini to have a anguish. And I don't want the Manjaris to have anguish. And I don't want my Guru, who's uh, in Manjari Swoop, to have anguish. I only want bliss for them. What do I do with this sadness I feel? And when the anxiety will come, then what will happen? There will be sadness and pain. So why not prepare this whole in loving action? That is not give pain to us. Anxiety for the lover, I miss. It's no problem. One reksha wala, one time go with that. And you say, every day I will go with you. And if you not go, his anxiety that you he lose one, his tourist. His anxiety that if you not come, he will not earn money. But that is the material anxiety he has. But you see here, in love, very intense anxiety comes. You know, your daughter say that I am coming at six. Uh, and he come, not, and some car of our, he will open the win window and check. Why you check? You have anxiety. And again, you sit comfortably, you start drinking coffee, and then some knock, some noise comes. Again, you go and check. She's there. Why are you worried about that? She will come. Your love is making this. Mm -hmm. And this love becomes more intense when she comes after half an hour late. In between half an hour, you start thinking, maybe something happened, adventure, and new love, white adventure. Then you think, no, no, she buys second hand. So maybe child can be punched. And all day, maybe some accident happened or what happened. I have to call and find out. Like this, you useless and you start anxiety. <laughs> Something happened to her. But she is not taking care of how she is coming. Well, my, many things start going because you love her. And this creates anxiety. You cannot to stop it. So this anxiety thing, Manjari is showing that the lover has more anxiety than who has no love. And he also becomes rush when he sees the flavor comes to his nose. Know this, who said that I love everyone, he also becomes an anxiety. God say I love everyone. Because I am a super soul, you also have to love everyone. So his nature is different than my Swami nature. Uh, and Swami said, I have no one. I have one lover, and this is a Krishna. Then Gopi said, why you love this man? He's a womanizer. So what I can do? He's a black looking. He's a calm man. He has no education. What I can do? I love <laughs> I love <laughs> You are a queen, and he is just no, nowhere, Radhe, but nowhere, nowhere, I like this. 
Makes the love good there, but the love makes this, but it also makes the love, doesn't it? The anxiety. Yes, anxiety makes you love. Why not your anxiety for A, B, C person? You where do you relate your anxiety? That is the situation of anxiety. In neutral relation, anxiety not him. When the man knows. Friend, you anxiety. Mother, you anxiety. We have more anxiety. And this same mother. And why Prabhupada? More Bhagavad Gita he writes about mother. Five type of mother. How many people are practicing to live in mother? All they live in passive because they want God. They were shipping for Baikunta. <laughs> in the name of Krishna, but they were ship Baikunta. Passive nature is a Baikunta worship. When Malo is not there, is a Baikunta. Huh? Check your heart. Where you what you're practicing affluence. So in the, when we're in the mellow, when we're having spiritual and not religious experience, I mean, then we're always spiritual and religious is a practical one. The spiritual is a divine and. Family life and behavior activities is like a practical room. How you will know mallow and how many mallows are there? Hmm. Chaitan Mahaprabhu say, Jesus say, Prabhupada say, after that we not understand hmm. if we not have a pain of motherly love. And mother, son is not torturing me. How I will understand. So it's never to transcend. The motherly love is never to transcend. It's always yes, motherly love, love is also trans. It this transcends to the divine. Because I have a practical experience of motherly love. I have no experience of mother. Then I select that I want to be a baby side of man side, or mother side. In Norway, they say that a woman who has had a baby never sleeps a whole night again in her life. And of course, this is the thing that. Are hmm. mother is going to supermarket? to buy the shopping and mother feeling that my baby is hungry. Mm. Why? How she is in a home mm. and mother is there and why is this feeling? Mm. Ask to mother. Mm. The baby will become hungry, mother will understand. Yeah. True. Why? This is divine. <laughs> Patani and lady understand all the behavior of the husband. She knows talk, but she knows. 
Lovers know everything. Some man hidingly do something, is she also understand? And the lady do anything hidingly, man understand. Why? How? How? Yes, it's a divine either way. Divine feeling starts. <laughs> that makes you clear to feel it. So feeling is more higher than knowledge. When I collect the only information is knowledge. Mm. And when I move in one line with that feeling is realized. But this experience of feeling is is not knowing when the daughter will come home. Not knowing if the, there's a car accident. It's wondering whether this is the divine. Doubt on the doubt. Yeah. It's not happened, nothing. Yeah. She arrived but it's thinking. after late. <laughs> but it make my mind nervous. And uh, nervous means my mind makes crazy to me to think so many things. It's not going to happen. She's there, isn't that? Then she come, or your daughter come to you, say, I'm very worried. Why you come so late? Huh? What is the worriedness? You not say that. But you know what is the worry? You happened. say, I knew you would come. <laughs> yeah, but I was very worried when you are late. Shera. <laughs> no? <clears throat> and this is also this oneness we have to come, become. No? Right. Love makes you oneness. But yeah, Chauda Tariko Rada Breath karna chahiye the bala bala. Us na chak prashal pahunji. Ha? No way. Alahar nahi. Everything is varieties of Krishna. Thank you, Tanur Govinda Prem.